Welcome to Big Braids and Crypto. I'm your host, Mr. Big Braids, coming to you live from a reservation somewhere. We're going to do uh, XLM. We do have uh, multiple coins that we've uh, added to the watch list, so we're just going to go through uh, some some random ones to uh, finish out the evening here. Uh, we'll start with XLM. Um, uh, we did add a lot of more coins to the uh, to the uh, watch list tonight, so we do we are going to have a lot more videos uh, uh, starting tomorrow. Uh, we just ha added these on here tonight. We're going to get it through as many as we can. Uh, did a few videos on that, but uh, as far as XLM goes, uh, looks like it came down. Tested the six one eight, uh, the seven eight six here, and uh, you know, I mean, at that point thirty two, it did have a decent uh, recovery. Came back up, tested this six one eight line here, came back down. It's been, you know, basically kind of skunking around. Got the same scenario that you know, just basically holding out waiting for, to see what BTC's next move is and uh, you know you always remember this is not financial advice uh, you know uh, it's my views and opinions on the market and uh, you know you always got to do what's right for you so I'll, I'll always remember that so um, you know I'm, I'm still looking for you know some lower prices here you know you know some you know most of these coins are always coming back to the 786 and testing so 32 cents you know especially if we get some pullback from BTC uh, you know I'm looking for geez you know I mean 28 cents would be pretty awesome uh, for some accumulation purposes as well as you know a decent buy-in on uh, uh, XLM it usually you know hangs around right here around 38 cents on the regular so uh, you know a price of 28 cents would be freaking amazing you know I would I would lo love to get some uh, you know accumulation for purposes for XLM uh, for those of you that are looking for you know <laughs> I mean that uh, I would love to have that lowest price on that one so uh, you know XLM you know it's XLM is looking pretty tough it does have some pretty decent news uh, so yeah you know those are some prices to watch you know i mean we could have some uh some uh you know consolidation sideways we could have this drop if the btc does have some pullback and uh you know xlm really does follow btc very well so if btc was to you know just basically start heading out xlm would get some good pump going with it too as well but btc starts to leave it behind we'll start to get some pullback action you know and uh, you know, I know everybody gets frustrated because they're like, what's going on? You know, what's going on with the coin? But it's, you know, it always comes back to BTC. Uh, let's take a look at another one. Let's see what do we got here. Uh, LCX. Uh, you know, uh, we had this one coming up. I never really uh, took a look at LCX. But, oh, man, this one, um, it looks like it basically you know it's 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 a pretty new coin it looks like it already came through the 786 line and broke it, it already came to the downside and uh it looks like it broke through the 786 line again it came back up and tried to test it again and uh it's it looks like it's really trying you know i mean as far as this coin goes i mean uh you know i mean it's it's looking not very well especially with we're, we're having to pull back to uh you know i mean with the btc uh you know if, if this is the floor here then you know that would pre probably be pretty awesome for one of these but uh you know as far as btc goes i mean geez i mean what is this i, I mean 10 cents here could probably be the possible floor for you know one of these and then one of these so you know i i mean but i mean there's only one place it can go right there so 10 cents that that's a good possibility that's where it's going to go uh especially with some pullback but you know lcx you know with just like with anything if this sucker gets some fu money it, it, it'll just you know uh head up to the moon so that you know lcx keep an eye on btc if it if btc does get some pullback you know i i'd seriously consider looking at this at uh 0.09 for you know the potential bottom and then one of these you know that that's just what it's been looking like but you know you, i mean you could argue is this consolidation but uh, with this being so new and it's starting up here just having i mean it's just looking like it's in a big death spiral down to the bottom here so if this is the bottom you know i mean i mean uh you know keep an eye on it you know if it does dip down here you know that i'm sure probably get one of these so uh but yeah lcx keep an eye on that one um and uh, let's see what else we got up on here uh Let's see here now. Could do some ETC. <clears throat> I know somebody wanted to talk about some ETC as well. So uh, yeah, be sure, always be, uh, be sure to like and subscribe. Uh, be sure to uh, uh, comment your coins you want to one up on the watch list. As you can tell, we've added quite a few. So but, uh, ETC seems like it's just basically been kind of skunking along. Uh, you know, it, it's testing the 786 line. It did have, you know, it did try to get some gas going. It looks like it's got a, you know, pretty decent. Uh, you know, when I see that, I, I think, you know, 
dippish, you know, especially with BTC, the way it's looking. ETC, uh, ETC usually tends to set up with BTC the same way. So it is testing the 786 here. Uh, you know, it's going to come back up and test Texas uh, 618 for, you know, some possible consolidation sideways. And then one of these, you know, once BTC gets to move in, but other than that, you know, if it does, if we do get some decent pullback on this one, you know, I'd be looking for, uh, you know, uh, 43, 43, $43 as far as ETC goes. So those are some price targets to look for as far as uh, ETC. Uh, what else we got on here? Um, let's see what, who else commented on? Uh, let's see, uh, take a look at engine coin. I believe that's what it, what it is here. Uh, uh, looks like it's already, you know, looks like it's getting some decent gas going as far as, uh, engine coin goes, but, uh, you know, I mean, this, this sucker has been getting some pretty decent moves. It's, uh, you know, whoever got in back here at $1.75 and it's just been steadily, you know, climbing to the upside here. Uh, it looks like it already had a move today, came through the 618, it did. You know, it did make it to 391, came back down, tested the 618. It actually did get a pretty good bounce. But, you know, like I always say, these they'll test the 618, come back up. And if we do get some DP action, uh, you know, it's going to come back down to probably uh, 299, which, you know, is a pretty decent for, for one or something like that. You know, you would hope for that, especially if uh, with BTC. But, you know, if, if the engine's got some good you know, some good, uh, um, FU money going, you know, this is on the table here for one of these, uh, you know, those, so those are some possibilities, but, uh, you know, that's, a, that's a few coins that I wanted to go through this evening. Um, so, uh, let's take a look. Uh, so yeah. So, uh, Mr. Big Braids is signing out. You also have a good evening.